Constantino. Ole. Pound for pound. Middle Giant You had a one year inactivity. Prior to that, you also had a one year inactivity. Do you feel that inactivity has to be because of your weight loss or just simply you need the time to take no, to because things of, out? No, because of the knee surgery that I had as well, you know, not a lot, a lot of people don't know that I had, that I had to get knee surgery and I took a little time out and maybe longer than usual because I was enjoying the family, you know, I worked so damn hard uh, to get to this point and um, taking a year off is not gonna, nope. it's not gonna hurt, man. As long as you train hard, you bust your ass off, that's why we had a long training camp exactly for this fight because I'm not underestimating anybody no more. What's it like with your new group of trainer? I know you've worked with him, you've had a history with him, but now with a full camp for, for this fight? It feels good because whenever I need him, boom, he's there. Um, he's available for me, you know? Everyone is just pushing me, pushing me to the limit, and um, I feel like I should have done this a long time ago, especially opening up my own gym. I feel like I could have been more disciplined, been more dedicated to this sport, and I'm still young, man. I'm still young. The, the future's super bright, and you just gotta work hard. Obviously, learning lessons. A lot of learning lessons, <laughs> especially from the roller coaster that I've been through my whole journey. Um, but from all the ups and downs, I know exactly what to do and what not to do right now. Two more questions. What would you say is the the biggest difference between a, a camp with your new trainer compared to Eddie? Um, I think uh, part of the the time and um, you know having having a lot of people just right there uh pushing you you know and and i'm the only really fighter there so i, I learned a lot from from eddie and them and i'm not saying that i would never go back or he would never help me because uh we have a lot of respect for him and but i feel uh the one-on-one -on -one is, is what's up now if you do get the usic fight and, and you win this fight would you think about going back to eddie to prepare for that fight of course, you know, because like I said, uh, he has a lot of experience and um, I would love for him to, to help me out and try to get those titles back. And right. I think Eddie would be a good, a, good, a good trainer too. That's a wrap, guys. Thank you very much. Thanks, Andy. Andy. Yeah, we'll be right this way.